This week is supported by the World Health Organization who recommend that babies are breastfed exclusively for the first six months of life and then after solids are introduced that breastfeeding continues for two years or longer. This is because as well as having all the nutrients your baby needs to grow and develop, human milk has very special ingredients such as antibodies, hormones and stem cells to help protect your baby now and in the future. Breastfeeding is also good for the mother's health and well-being and with breastfeeding mummies at lower risk of breast cancer, ovarian cancer, osteoporosis, type 2 diabetes and endometriosis. With that being said, Northern Ireland has the lowest breastfeeding rates in the UK and one of the lowest rates right across Europe. Whilst half of all new mummies here do start breastfeeding, many quickly stop, often because they feel there's a lack of support particularly they want to feed their baby outside the home <laughs> and which can result in feelings of maybe embarrassment or being judged by others. The breastfeeding welcome here scheme yeah? <laughs> was, um, was developed to encourage businesses and public premises to welcome mums as I know it's simply impossible to breastfeed unless you become comfortable doing so in public. Many local businesses now here are, are registered with the Breastfeeding Welcome Here scheme, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, and they all appear on an interactive map, and that map is available if you want to check it out on the breastfeedbabies.org website. If businesses are interested in signing up to the initiative with these restrictions with lockdown all easing, please do, do not hesitate to contact the health inequalities officers within our council. Um, you will have saw as well that as Chair of Council I have launched a, a recognition award for you to nominate a peer support volunteer who, may, is a, who would be attached to one of the two local um, health trusts and they might have helped you on your breastfeeding journey. So simply email in the name of your peer support and the reason for your nomination. I was um, very fortunate as my mum had breastfed. Sorry Polly. As my mum had breastfed me and many of my friends had done too. So really it was a natural step for me to breastfeed both of my babies and I was really really fortunate uh, to have been able to feed both of them um, for, for over a year but I know that getting started is really really difficult um, and even more difficult for those who don't have direct support which is why the peer support um, scheme plays such an important role and um, I was delighted to see actually over the period of lockdown that our um, breastfeeding rates here in the north had increased so let's do all we can to build upon that.